Hey, what's up, man? This is Big Grime, and I, I want to talk about um, how to be successful. And there's one thing that's common in everything that you're trying to do and be successful in. Um, number one is what is your goal? Now, a lot of you is going to say, "Oh, yeah, you know, you know, I want to do this, I want to do that," or, you know. I want to get my song played on the radio. I want to get written about in magazines. I want to, or, or the newspaper. I want people to buy my songs. I want to get shows. <clears throat> and the thing is, people are not uh, thinking about how can I reach there. Like, for instance, if my goal is to get written in a magazine about my music, then I need to go straight to that magazine and ask them, how can I... You know, what is it going to take for you to write about me? Or how can I get in your magazine? Go on to the radio station and say, hey, man, what is it going to take for you to play my music? And, you know, and tell them to be, you know, honest. Like, what is it really going to take? And that kind of sets a standard of what you have to do to achieve your goals. Because you can have goals, but if you don't know how to get there, you know, then you're going to be lost. I mean, can you imagine trying to get played on the radio and you really don't know what they're looking for I mean you could be sending them music or approaching them with music that they're not looking for or you know or they say hey we only accept music through this channel or this company or these people so okay if that's the case then I know that I need to get to these people in order to get to the radio station but if I never knew that and I'm going straight to the radio station then I'm, I'm, all my time and effort is being wasted. You see what I'm saying? So when you define your goal and what you want to do, or you're trying to work with somebody, you need to go to these people and say, hey, I want to do this. I want to work with you. I want to be involved in this. What is it going to take for me to get involved? Because I know, um, I know you know, DJs that are on a like radio station. I'm going to use them for an example. <clears throat> They get approached by, you know, unsigned artists all the time. And then, you know, the question, you know, they say, hey, man, can you play my music, listen to my song, my demo? They get that all the time. I guarantee you, if you was to ask them, hey, what is it going to take, you know, for you to play my music? Like, what what are you looking for? What situation do I have to be in? Who do I need to be associated with, etc.? Then you have a better insight because everything's different. You know, everybody's different. You know, everybody do things differently. So what worked from one place may not work for another. So you may successfully guide in the show at this place using those same methods somewhere else may not work. So, you know, you basically got to ask, what is it going to take to reach my goal? And um, that's pretty much my tip right there, man. Um, make sure you check me out, verbnation.com backslash big grime and, um, and also at myspace.com backslash Big Grime 1. Not, you don't have to spell out number 1. Just type number 1. Alright? Peace. Alright, so if you like the video, a great way to show appreciation is to share it with your friends. Uh, what you could do is go below the video and you'll see Share. And you'll see the Facebook and Twitter you know, logo. Click on there. Now you could just copy this link right here. And just put it in, you know, on your Facebook or send it to your friends by email or instant messenger. Um, but I'm going to make it a lot easier for you. You could click on Facebook, Twitter, MySpace tabs, um, Bebo, etc. But to share with, you know, with your friends on uh, YouTube, click on email. Yeah, they're, they're probably more likely going to want to see it since they're already on YouTube. Some people that are on MySpace or Twitter, they may not be on YouTube. Now, you see all your contacts right here. If you scroll all the way down, you can add all friends or all contacts. Um, probably you want to add all friends because they're guaranteed to be on YouTube. Some of your contacts may not be on YouTube. But if you click on all friends, you see your friends right here. It just says friends. But that means it's going to send to all your friends on YouTube. I have a video that talks about editing rap vocals. So let's say if you wanted to share that video, you would, you know, go to share, click on all friends, 
and then send a personal message saying, hey, this is, this. I think this is a great video on how to edit your rap vocals. And then click send. And it'll send to all your friends. So um, if you could do that, if you enjoyed my video, if you could do that, share it with your friends, I appreciate it. Thanks.